Hi, and welcome to today's ironing tutorial on how to use pay range to pay for your laundry at your apartment. So first up, to be able to use pay range, the first thing that you're gonna have to do is actually get the app. So it's just called pay range and it works on both iOS and Android. So of course, first off, you're gonna have to download the app, sign up and get an account, and then add funds to your account. And once you've done that, you're going to be able to actually pay for any of your laundry cycles on both the washers and dryers. So you may be asking yourself, okay, so now I have the app and I funded it, but how do I actually use it? So that's what we're going to be showing you today. So if you want to do a washing machine cycle, of course, the first step will be just adding in any of your laundry. Once all your laundry is inside, of course, close the door. Next step, of course, put in any of your detergent, softener, bleach, etc. just as if you're going to do a normal load. So then the next step after that will be on the front side of your machine, there's obviously different cycles. You know, you can choose your soil level, cycle type, or temperature. So just like usual, you're going to want to choose whatever you want for the cycle of laundry that you want to do. Um, just as one point to note is that the price and amount of time that your load takes is dependent on the soil type. So as you'll see, for a light cycle, it's $2. For a medium, 225 and for heavy it's 250. Now this might differ um, depending on what apartment complex you're at but just note that it's the soil level that actually really affects the price and how long your load runs for. So once your laundry is loaded inside you put in your detergent and whatnot then on the front side of the panel you'll just want to select what type of load you want. So for instance say I want to do a light cycle that's normal and warm. So I'll select all that on my front panel. Now, the next thing that you're gonna to wanna to do is have the pay range app. So once you have the pay range app on your phone, the way that you're able to connect to the washers and dryers is basically via Bluetooth. So, so long as you have Bluetooth enabled on your phone, you'll be able to connect to the washers and dryers. So the way that you're actually able to know which machine that you wanna to connect to is based upon the number on top of the machine. So as you can see, for this washing machine, there's a number one on top, which means it's washer number one. And then for this washing machine, you can see that it's labeled with number two, so you know that this is washer number two. So once you've you know, got everything set up, laundry inside, detergent, and you've selected the cycle on the front, then the next thing that you'll do is you'll open up the app. So from within the app, when you're inside the laundry room, close enough such that Bluetooth can connect, you'll see the various different machines you can connect to. So since I'm going to be showing you how to work with washer number one, what you'll do is on the app, you'll select that washing machine. So if I just select that, then from here, it'll pull up that we're now interacting with washing machine number one. So once you've actually pulled up that, you'll be able to actually select the different type of cycle that you wanna run. So there's a drop down menu here, and as you can see, there's a light cycle, medium cycle, and heavy cycle. And the prices are the same here as they correspond as, as if you were just paying with coins. So since for this demonstration, we'll be showing how to do a light cycle with normal and warm water, all I have to do is from the app, select the light cycle. And then all I have to do is click slide to pay. Now, when I uh, actually slide this bar across, what we'll see is that the price on the washing machine is going to decrease as it, and kind of show you as if I was paying with coins. And so after I've actually slid to pay and you see the price decrease, then all you have to do is press start and your load will start. So to show that now, if I just slide this across, it'll connect to the machine. Now you can see that obviously we've paid for the cycle and all we have to do now is click start. So now we can see that the door is locked and as we can see, the cycle has started. So that is how to use pay range to pay for your laundry. And another nice perk of the app is that it will have a time estimate of how long the cycle is going to run for. So basically, for instance, right here, 
we just started the load on machine number one and you can see that it's estimating um, and showing you the time. So this will help you actually know how long your load's gonna run for so you can have a general idea of when you need to come back down to get your laundry out. So that is how you can use pay range to pay for your laundry. And if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to support. Thank you.